Yo, 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 yo. Yo, my name is Brandon Munson. My name is Brandon Munson. I am YouTuber. My name is Brandon Munson. I'm a YouTuber. You subscribe to my channel. Get the shout outs. Thank you. Have a great day. We're in Star Wars watching TV. Letting you know where I come from. I come from your mama's basement because I effed her in the bed last night. Her bed was in the basement of your mama's house. It's just a joke, man. Why are you getting offended? You, this stupid generation trying to get offended with these liberals and these gays and these lesbians and these transgenders and all these crazy guys. And it's not just them Islamic phobic, all the other things they want. They want to call you names. You know what, guys? I just thought of something. Hold on. LGBTQ? I just, you know what? Hold on, let me phrase that. Translation. The LGBTQ community stands for lesbians, lesbians, gays, bisexuals, transgender. That's what it stands for. The Q, I don't know. Q, I don't know what that stands for. Um, but, you know, guys, I'm. it's not just them. I, I'm talking about this new generation. They get offended so easily when you call them out. Is this a joke, man? I don't know if you live in your mama's basement. I don't care. If not, it's the attic. Your mama's attic. Oh. Roasted. I don't care about your feelings, okay? I speak the truth. And if that's the truth, then your life sucks. And no, I don't live in my mama's basement. I don't have a basement. My house ain't big enough for a basement. But, you know... Ha 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 ha. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Alright, this time I was actually laughing. But guys, let me tell you something, okay? You know, it's not just liberals, conservatives get offended too. Yes, I mean to get political because... You know, we live in a world today where... Everybody gets so easily offended. If any of these guys would name one thing they don't get offended about... I'll give them a shout out... And feature them in a video... TikTok video. If you don't have me on TikTok, follow me on TikTok. I'm not with Mr. TikTok on TikTok. Nation2021. My username on TikTok. Um, TikTok Nation2021. I'm on TikTok. Go follow me there. Help me reach my goal on TikTok at 3,000 followers. If you do, I'll give you a shout out. And the reason I give you all a shout out on TikTok is because y'all get what you get. And also, because you're my followers on TikTok. And some of my subscribers on YouTube are followers on my tech, on mine on TikTok. So go follow me on there, on that app. Go check it out. And like this video if you already have. And, yeah. Oh, also, I wanted to address one thing about Hamez. Hamez, I have a question for you, Hamez. Hamez, how do you want me to pronounce your name? Because I want to let you know in the comments if you are watching this man and me and my fans explain to us I know you don't go on YouTube as much like me or anyone else does but Hamez, I just want to address one thing why did you call me an idiot? you wanted me to read your messages and you said, oh, Brandon, you know, read messages, you effing idiot. Exactly his words. Not mine, his. And I know this was a year ago. And you want me to let this go and this and that. But you know, it's hard to let things go when you've been treated a certain way for years online. On the internet. You know, I've always been called idiots. You know, if you guys are, isn't this, this doesn't just go for Hermes. This goes for anybody. If you are going to express yourselves, if you are going to ask, or if you want me to read your messages, your messages were stupid, by the way. You were just offending me. You were trolling me. I saw the messages. I read them after you called me idiots, and I didn't appreciate it. You guys are just trolling me. You guys are just saying, read this, read that. And you know what? F you, man. I'm not no idiot. And, yeah, I said F you because I'm tired of being called idiots. I'm tired of being called stupid. I'm tired of being called retard and all these other things. Yes, I made mistakes before, and I'm sorry, but sh uh, some of you caused it because of the messages 
and all these other things that you cause with the fake accounts and all these other things. You know, I'm tired of it. Mess with the wrong one. Call me that again one more time, and I'm going to roast you. I'll roast you so hard you will never say that word again. Why don't you look up the word idiots before you say it? Half this world needs to research freaking words before they use them on the internet. That goes for me too. But I actually do research when I'm not on the internet. What? By internet, I mean YouTube. When I'm not making videos, I do my research. I check things out for themselves. Because I don't want to know the history behind it and what the word actually means. So, also, bigot means intolerant of someone else's opinions. We're all bigots by definition because that's what it means, intolerant of someone else's opinions. I'll be honest, I've been a bigot before, okay? And I am man enough to admit it. If you are, comment below. But just, if you're going to express yourselves, be nice about it. And if you have nothing nice to say, don't say it to anybody. Don't say it at all. Just keep it to yourself. If you were really were smart, you wouldn't be calling someone names. You let God be the judge of that. The only man who can judge is Jesus Christ. Because he's a righteous judge. We're not. I am not. You're not. Nobody is. Celebrities are not either. Now, y'all want to act like celebrities are God, but when the real God starts judging you, that's on you. So, don't mess with me. Don't call me names. Don't threaten to take me down because you're not going to. Just don't. All talk, no action. That's all I have to say. If you don't want to get roasted, be quiet.